Hi, I'm Megan and this is Jessie. Hello, friends. I heard it's going to be a beautiful day tomorrow, Jessie. I think I may go for a walk in the park. Are you doing anything fun tomorrow? Well, my cousin from Texas is coming to visit. He is staying at our house. But I'll be honest, I don't know how much fun that will be. Well, it's great when family comes to visit. Why wouldn't it be fun? Well, my mom said I gotta let my cousin sleep in my bed and I have to sleep on the floor. My bed is so fluffy and soft and, uh, well, the floor is, uh, not. <laughs> Jesse, it sounds like you are showing love to your cousin by making a sacrifice. A sacrifice? Yeah. You are giving up your soft, fluffy bed so your cousin has a comfortable place to sleep. You are showing your cousin that you care about him by making a sacrifice and choosing to sleep on the floor. Huh, I didn't think about it like that, Megan. Uh, I do love my cousin, and this is a great way to show him how much I care about him. That's right. Jesus made the greatest sacrifice to show us how much he loves us. Jesus gave up his own life so we could be with God forever. Let's watch our Bible story video to learn more about the sacrifice Jesus made. Long ago, God gave his people the law so that they could understand that God is holy and the people are sinners. The law could not save the people, but it pointed to something greater. Under the law, the people made sacrifices for their sins, but they were still guilty. A sacrifice of bulls and goats cannot take away people's sins. Jesus came to be the sacrifice for sin. He came to do God's plan and offer himself as the perfect sacrifice for sin, the final sacrifice. Under the law, the priests made sacrifices for sin. The next day, they made sacrifices again. Those sacrifices never took away sins. Jesus came to offer himself one time. Then he sat down at God's right hand. With one sacrifice, Jesus takes away the sin of everyone who trusts in him. God said, I will never again remember their sins and the wrong things they have done. Because God forgives us, we don't have to make a sacrifice to pay for sins. So God calls us to live in a way that honors Him. We can go to Him anytime without fear. Jesus made the way for us to have clean hearts. Jesus gives us hope and we can tell the world about it. We can trust Him to do all he has promised. We can help one another do what is right, loving others and doing good works. We can meet together and encourage one another because one day Jesus will come again. Jesus came to be the sacrifice for sin. He lived a perfect life, died on the cross and rose from the dead. When we trust in him, God forgives our sins forever.